Hey guys, this is Rob. So I got a question for you. What do you do when your best friend gets diagnosed with cancer? The answer, anything you can do. My best friend, Dave Wade, was diagnosed about a couple months ago. Um, and he's going through it. His family's going through it. And his friends and family are going through it as well. And so this is my point of view. I'll do some vlogs until he gets better. Sound good? Awesome. So today, we're having a fundraiser for his family at Barker Park in Ogden, Utah. This was all set up by his wife's niece, Laura Hales, um, which I'll do an interview with her later. And it's been pretty awesome, the amount of support, um, not just financially, but spiritually and emotionally that the family has gotten uh, through this time. Um, just a little bit of background, me and Dave met at church. Um, and we became fast friends. Totally fell in love with his family. Me and his wife have the worst conversations known to man, but they're hilarious. Their kids call me Black Rob because I'm the only black person within a five mile radius of where we live. And I love it. So he told me a few months earlier he had a lump in his neck and he wasn't sure what it was and he was freaking out. Now Dave's a huge dude. So to him be scared was a pretty big deal. And then when uh, he called me up and asked for a blessing, um, I was like, okay. And that's when I found out he was going in to find out exactly what was going on because it had gotten bigger. None of the medicine had helped. So, of course, I was there quick, fast, and in a hurry. And I remember it was one of the few blessings um, that I've given for healing where it literally was not positive at all. Um, as far as you'll get better or it won't be cancer, it was just straight up, your family will need to be strengthened at this time. And I'm, I almost wanted to withdraw my hands from the blessing. I felt like we were, we were giving it to him. And I remember we just cried and it was, it was a tough night. And then he called me the next, or texted me the next day and it was yes. And, um, but he's been so positive and so upbeat about it. Um started doing chemo a few weeks ago and his hair fall, fell out obviously and so me and a bunch of his other buddies that were actually already bald and shaved their heads and so I shaved mine as you see it grew back uh, it hurt <laughs> I get razor bumps so I'm a baby but I'm here showing love and support for the Wade family uh, if you know somebody and you probably do that has cancer or has had cancer uh, show support any way that you can. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.